Hello ham friends, this is Hotel Bravo 9 Echo Alpha Juliet and I'm on a summit to test the TX500 a firmware update that I just installed yesterday evening. Stay tuned! The beacon mode can be found on the menu on number 3030 and the first you will see beacon CW and I now switch to a beacon VO which is the new mode and there uh, you can adjust um, the number of seconds so I set it now to 10 seconds it's always a bit difficult to see it here through the smartphone but I guess it's right you you go back to um, to the menu so return and uh, so let's see I go to a free frequency let's see if this frequency is in use very handy to have that uh, saved on one and especially on v, um, VON or VOM2 because uh, this uh, beacon mode only works on VOM1 as I read in the manual yesterday evening so I show you now how it works I recorded before a call So now it will make a 10 seconds a pause. Now just wait a moment. And it just comes again. And so to to stop it, I what I did when I tried it before, I just pressed the the, the microphone quickly and it's gone. Now I press the microphone and it's gone. So if somebody calls you, you just uh, take the microphone and talk. Maybe you can also press the button. This is possible. I didn't try, but this seems to me uh, the easiest. So that's about the, the, the beacon for voice. Yeah, and the second issue that uh, mainly affects uh, people from the UK is uh, the the frequency range you can use on 60 meters in transmit mode so to do that to to test it i uh, reduce the power to the minimum which is 10 percent and the mid gain to one percent and i just reach now at the maximum at the upper uh, frequency range which is a five four zero six decimal five kilocycles and uh, so here I can transmit still but I can't go further up if now let's go further down and let's see where it stops it's at a five two five eight decimal five so that's the new frequency range uh, that mainly affects the UK hams here um, in, in Switzerland, France, Germany and so on in Central Europe we don't have that much allocation, unfortunately. Now I hike to the second summit. Yeah, the sun is getting lower and uh, slowly, slowly I will head back home. Uh, it looks nice up here. I like very much the, the Vosges. This is my antenna and I heavily used the beacon mode for voice. Um, the reason is uh, I heard at one moment I heard many stateside uh, signals on uh, 15 meters, 17 meters, 20 meters uh, some very strong ones, probably running high power. But uh, yeah, the first the problem is I had to use APRS until you enter the the frequencies and so on. It's it's really it takes some time. It's much easier when you have network, which I don't have here. 
So, yeah, unfortunately no stateside contacts, but I did uh, in total uh, 32, I just checked before. 32 contacts, also not too bad um, for the late afternoon on this second summit. And the TX500 uh, works as it should, perfectly fine. Um, uh, don't know anything to complain about. It's just uh, great to use it. Okay, so I hope I could uh, give some pointers about the firmware update. And uh, let's see what the next ones will bring us, which kind of features, which uh, fixes. I'm absolutely happy as it is there right now. Thanks for watching. Best 73. Bye bye.